Uh, today I'm joined by Dr. Roz Wilson, who's recently joined Factor Therapeutics as the CEO. Uh, Roz, welcome uh, to the Morgans Network. Thanks very much, Scott. Pleasure um, to be here. Wondering if I can just start by asking what attracted you to join the Factor Therapeutics team? It's a, it's a terrific opportunity for me, I think, um, not only in terms of the contribution that I feel I can make, but also I really feel it's an environment where I'm going to really enjoy what I'm doing. The company's at a very interesting point in its development. We have a product with significant potential to really make a difference to patients, and that's something that's very important to me. We have a fantastic team. The management group are terrific. The board is extremely committed, and everybody's worked, I think, very hard to bring things to this point, um, where we have a very sound platform for moving things to the next phase. Oh, great. So I'm wondering if you could tell us uh, what your previous experience was and what you think you can bring to the Factor Therapeutics company. I've been in the industry for a little over 20 years and half of that was in the international environment. I've had a range of roles from uh, multinational pharmaceuticals where I was a global project leader right through to strategic consultancy both uh, from within a company and also as a sole provider and that was in both Australia and overseas. Um, and I've also worked in the not-for-profit environment helping to drive the creation of investigator-initiated research. Um, I guess the common theme across all of those roles is that I've always worked at the interface of science, um, the needs of patients and business uh, to develop new medicines. I think I, well, I know what it takes to bring a medicine through clinical development and the regulatory approval process. I love working in teams. I really enjoy being a leader of a team. Mm -hmm. I can work with a wide range of people I have and I, I really enjoy that. Um, and I think I also bring an appreciation of the importance of strategy and planning, but perhaps balanced by a fairly healthy streak of pragmatism. Great. Okay, so I know you've only been at um, Factor for a couple of days now, but <laughs> looking at the next 12 months, what do you see are the key uh, areas that have to be achieved and what are some of the key challenges? Well clearly um, we have a, a very uh, obvious first priority which is to ensure that our phase two trial um, continues um, uh, to move along and to deliver that trial successfully. But I think a close second is that we need to ensure that we're ready for end of phase two activities. And then looking to the future, uh, we need to take a bit of a step back and take a broader view of some of the other opportunities that are available to us and look at how we can really build on our program and our portfolio. Well, it uh, looks like a very interesting year for Factor Therapeutics and yeah. uh, obviously you've joined it at a very interesting time in the company's history. So uh, welcome to the team and thank you for joining the Morgans Network today. Thank you very much.